quick look today at the Tonbux mini keyboard with integrated touchpad. This one's from the Tonbux brand and they have their own range of Android boxes too, but there are quite a few out there that are similar to this. Looking at the front of the box, you'll get some more information on this. The main point to note here is the adjustable touchpad DPI, so you can control the speed. And on the back, it shows you some of the devices you can connect to. Now, these are quite popular for Android boxes and computers, as well as smartphones, if you use the on-the-go cable. Um, do bear in mind that for TVs, not all the functions work, and that's the same with any of the keyboards and touchpads that I've used. On the front we have the rubberized keypad, you'll note the left and right mouse buttons are also on the left side. At the top part we have a power switch and there is a mini USB plug for charging. I might have gone with the micro but uh, still you get the cable included for that. Now the light flashes until it's got a connection and it goes out and it just comes on when you actually press a key. Opening the back cover you see the nano USB dongle, you just plug that into the device spare USB port. Now the lithium battery is included with this but there aren't any contacts for AAAs. Some of these do have the contacts for the smaller types of batteries so you're reliant completely on the lithium cell here but you can charge it and use it at the same time. Quick look at the battery, it looks very similar to some of the older Nokia types but it's replaceable which is nice to see. And here I'm just charging the keypad, you'll see the white LED glow when that's plugged in. The far right one is a low power warning, so it lets you know when there isn't much power left and you need to recharge the keypad. Moving a bit closer at some of the keys, USA layout on this, so bear that in mind if you're in Europe or in the UK, but it's not something that really bothers me. Now this is a fairly simple and basic touchpad. Uh, there are some around that have backlights and extra functions, but this is pretty good for what it is. Uh, it's also quite solid and well made. So if you have an Android box in particular, I definitely recommend picking one of these because it's much easier to control the box with this keypad.